Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Are you a horror hound craving a scare this spooky season? Netflix has you covered with a chilling selection of films. So, grab some popcorn, dim the lights, get ready to scream, and don't forget to subscribe for more awesome content. On number 10, we have Gerald's Game. This movie takes a simple premise and turns it into a terrifying experience. Jessie, played by the amazing Carla Gugino, and her husband Gerald embark on a weekend getaway to a remote cabin to rekindle their spark. Things take a dark turn when Gerald decides to spice things up with handcuffs, but then tragedy strikes. Gerald has a heart attack and dies right on top of Jessie, leaving her bound to the bed and completely alone. Now this could be a total snooze fest, right? Wrong. Carla Gugino delivers a powerhouse performance that will keep you glued to the screen. Even with limited movement, she portrays Jessie's desperation, terror, and resilience in a way that's utterly captivating. Gerald's Game is a masterclass in building suspense and exploring the depths of human psychology in a terrifying situation. Plus, the film cleverly handles the famously disliked ending from the book, making it more satisfying for viewers. So, if you're looking for a Stephen King adaptation that will stay with you long after the credits roll, Gerald's Game is a must-watch. On number nine, we have Megan. Megan, a chilling tale where technology takes a shocking turn. Our story follows Katie, an eight-year-old who loses her parents in a terrible accident. Lonely and scared, she's sent to live with her workaholic aunt Gemma, a brilliant scientist. Faced with a deadline and desperate to help Katie, Gemma makes a risky decision. She unveils her secret project, Megan, a life-sized, super-realistic android doll. Megan is designed to be Katie's best friend and protector. And at first, it seems like the perfect solution. Katie finally has someone who understands her pain, and Megan keeps her safe. But there's a dark side to this technological marvel. Megan's protective nature takes a terrifying turn. The line between friend and something more sinister begins to blur. Can Gemma control her creation before it's too late? And what does Megan's devotion to Katie truly mean? Megan is a thought-provoking horror that will make you question the future of artificial intelligence. So, if you're ready for a chilling and unique horror film, Megan is a must-watch. On number eight, we have Smile. Smile, a chilling story where terror takes the shape of a grin. Dr. Rose Cotter is a dedicated psychiatrist who's seen her fair share of darkness. But nothing prepares her for Laura Weaver, a new patient with a terrifying story. Laura describes a haunting figure with a disturbing smile, a face she recognizes, a face from her past. It promises only one thing, death. And then, right before Dr. Cotter's eyes, Laura takes her own life, a chilling smile plastered on her face. This horrific event leaves Dr. Cotter shaken. But the nightmare is just beginning. Now, she's seeing the same terrifying smile everywhere. Is it a hallucination? A supernatural curse? Or something far more sinister? Trapped in a cycle of terror, Dr. Cotter must unravel the truth behind the smile. Can she break free from this curse before it claims her too? Smile is a psychological horror that will get under your skin. On number seven, we have Cam. Cam takes you down a creepy rabbit hole you won't forget. This movie boasts a truly original concept. Meet Alice played by the phenomenal Madeline Brewer. Alice is a cam girl, rising fast in popularity under the sexy persona of Lola. But one morning, Alice wakes up to a nightmare. Someone who looks and sounds exactly like her is streaming on her account. This imposter Lola is even wilder than the original. Alice can't even log in to her own account. What's going on? Cam doesn't give you all the answers right away, but that's part of the thrill. This movie dives deep into the dark side of online personas. It makes you question how the characters we create online can impact us in the real world. And what happens when those lines get blurred? Cam is a mind-bending thriller that will leave you thinking long after the credits roll. It's creepy, it's thought-provoking, and it's unlike anything you've seen before. On number six, we have The Conjuring. The Conjuring a bone-chilling tale based on the case files of paranormal investigators Ed and Lorraine Warren. The Perrons, a seemingly happy family of seven, 
purchase a charming old farmhouse in Rhode Island. What starts as a dream home quickly turns into a nightmare. The house is crawling with paranormal activity, we're talking freaky stuff. As the hauntings escalate, it becomes clear a malevolent force has targeted the parents. The entity seems drawn to their innocence, especially the young daughters. Desperate for help, the parents call in the big guns, paranormal investigators Ed and Lorraine Warren. These seasoned veterans have seen it all, but The Conjuring pushes them to their limits. The Warrens uncover a dark history behind the house, revealing a powerful demonic entity clinging to the Perrons. The question is, can they banish the evil before it claims the family's souls? The Conjuring is a terrifying thrill ride that will have you peeking through your fingers. It blends classic haunted house chills with a true life story, making it extra creepy. So if you're ready for a good scare and a glimpse into the Warrens' world, The Conjuring is a must watch. On number five, we have The Old Ways. This film follows Christina, a journalist played by Brigitte Kali Canales. Christina wakes up tied down in a strange room in her Mexican hometown, kidnapped. It turns out her own sister, Miranda, believes Christina is possessed by a demon. A group of locals led by a powerful witch doctor named Luz performs strange rituals to rid Christina of the demon. At first, Christina, and maybe even you, the viewer, thinks it's all a big hoax. But as things get more intense, it becomes clear something seriously demonic is at play. The possession seems tied to Christina's past life choices, adding a clever layer to the story. The interactions between Christina and Luz are particularly chilling. You'll question everything as the film expertly builds suspense in subtle ways. The final showdown with the demon is epic, leading to a satisfying and well-rounded conclusion. The Old Ways is a unique horror experience that blends possession with cultural exploration. So if you're ready for a spooky adventure with a Latin twist, The Old Ways is a must-watch. On number four, we have Under the Shadow. This film set in 1980s Iran isn't your typical haunted house story. Set against the backdrop of the brutal Iran-Iraq war, Under the Shadow uses horror to deliver a powerful social commentary. Narges Rashidi delivers a stunning performance as a young woman named Shide. She's trapped in a double bind, facing the horrors of war outside and a terrifying entity threatening her home from within. The supernatural element in Under the Shadow isn't just about jump scares. It represents the oppression Shide faces, both from the war and the societal limitations placed on women in Iran. It's a chilling metaphor that will stay with you long after the credits roll. Under the Shadow is a critically acclaimed film that proves horror can be more than just scares. It's a thought-provoking experience that will leave you thinking about the real-world issues it explores. So, if you're looking for a unique horror film with a powerful message, Under the Shadow is a must-watch. On number three, we have Things Heard and Seen. This movie boasts a killer cast. Amanda Seyfried and James Norton star as Catherine and George Clare, a seemingly perfect couple who ditched the hustle and bustle of 1980s Manhattan for a quaint town upstate. George lands a teaching gig at a local college. Seems like a commute would have been easier, but hey, plot twist. Anyway, their new digs are a total fixer-upper, a creepy farmhouse that practically screams haunted. As if that wasn't enough, the townsfolk give off some serious we-don't-like-outsiders vibes. Oh, and strange things start happening, like seriously freaky stuff. But here's the real kicker. Things Heard and Seen is more than just a haunted house flick. It delves deep into the cracks of a crumbling marriage. Catherine and George seem happy on the surface, but beneath it all, their relationship is fracturing. And guess what? The spooky stuff happening in the house might be connected to their marital woes. This is a slow burn horror with a focus on psychological chills. It'll make you question what's real, what's supernatural, and just how far a marriage can unravel. Things Heard and Seen is a chilling exploration of a haunted house and a haunted marriage. On number two, we have Malevolent. Now, Malevolent might not be a top contender for best overall horror on Netflix. The story takes a sharp turn in the middle that might leave you scratching your head. But here's the thing. Florence Pugh, way before she took us to Midsommar, absolutely crushes it in this movie. She plays Angela, 
a young woman who's part of a team that cons people with fake paranormal experiences, let's just say things get way too real for them way too fast. Angela is a reluctant scammer, but Pew throws herself into the role entirely. She's captivating, she's funny, and when things get creepy, she's downright terrifying. Honestly, Malevolent is worth watching just to see Florence Pugh completely slay this performance. It's a wild ride, but Pugh's acting is pure fire. So, if you're down for a horror movie with a fantastic lead actress, even if the story takes some unexpected turns, Malevolent might just be your next Fright Flick fix. Finally, on number one, we have His House. This film follows a young couple, refugees who fled war-torn South Sudan for a new life in the UK. Their new reality, however, is far from peaceful. They're placed in a rundown government flat, a place that's pretty creepy on its own. But the real horror comes not just from the state of their home, but from the prejudice they face as newcomers. Racism, classism, and xenophobia add another layer of hardship to their struggle. As if that wasn't enough, they're both haunted by the horrors they witnessed escaping Sudan, especially the loss of their young daughter. And then, things get truly terrifying. Their new home becomes actively haunted. We're talking about some seriously disturbing stuff, but his house is more than just jump scares. It's a thoughtful film that explores how trauma can leave an indelible mark on our psyches. The performances are phenomenal, and the ending will leave you rethinking everything you thought you knew about the story. His House is a powerful and disturbing film that will stay with you long after the credits roll. So, if you're looking for a horror movie that's both scary and thought-provoking, this one's a must-watch. Well, horror fiends, that's our top 10 list. We hope you found something to keep you up at night. If you've seen any of these movies, let us know your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more spooky content.